So integration is the linkage of differentiated parts. So like between me and you right now, Rich, I need to honor the differences between me and you to promote differentiation, but then I need to cultivate linkage through compassionate communication. And this integrative communication that is honoring differences, promoting linkages, can be seen as the source of a healthy relationship that you and I have um, between us and, and that we're demonstrating, you know, in this collaborative, what's called contingent communication right here in this moment. When children are fortunate enough, and about two-thirds are in the non clinical population, when they're fortunate enough to have parents who can offer them that kind of integrative communication, research and attachment, which doesn't use the concept of integration, but as an attachment researcher, I've kind of translated attachment uh, mm -hmm. findings through the lens of interpersonal neurobiology, and I see attachment research basically is showing that when relationships are integrative in the communication patterns that parents offer, number one, they come from parents who have made sense of their own lives, and that's in, explored in the developing mind and then translated to parents and parenting from the inside out, which I wrote with Mary Hartzell. Now, your own self-understanding is the best predictor of how a child would be attached to you as a parent, so that's a starting place. But the next place after making sense of your own life, which you can do in the Inside Out book, is you say, well, then how do I help promote integration in my child? Well, you can demonstrate through very practical strategies how understanding, for example, how the left and right brain are differentiated and then linked can help you as a parent when you understand the different phases of development these two hemispheres go through knowing this can teach you very practical strategies on linking left and right. Okay. And you realize the higher parts of the nervous system, for the cortex for example, are differentiated from the lower limbic and brainstem and even somatic or bodily areas. This is a vertical distribution. You can learn techniques as a parent very readily once you get the concept of integration to promote differentiation and then linkage.